Now, before we begin, I'd like to inform you that the Worm Farming Revolution book is available in a paperback, ebook, and Amazon Kindle. It's the largest practical worm farming guide to date and in color. Other publications by Polly Picciarolo are Worm Farming Revealed Secret Recipe, My Personal Recipe and Methodology for Growing Large, High Yielding, and Pest Resistant Plants, the completely editable Worm Farming PowerPoint presentation. Now you can present the benefits of worm farming and speak with authority. The Worm Farming Coloring and Activity ebook. Download the book, print as many pages as you want, and get kids excited. The free Worm Farming PDF guide as a newsletter subscriber or available to view at the website. And lastly, the Beneficial's two-hour screenplay. All proceeds go towards getting this screenplay to producers and studios who are looking to educate and entertain the world through nature. Download the Beneficial's pitch deck and the one-minute trailer in the link below. Check out the Amazon merch if you'd like to support the message of healthy living soil. Let's begin. This publication is copyrighted. All photos are the property of the author. No reproduction of any kind, including screenshots, are prohibited unless given permission. You are listening to the preface. First, I want to congratulate you if you are reading this right now. You have just turned the first page of a new chapter in living a healthier life, growing your own food, recycling, and most importantly, sustaining yourself. Maybe you're opening an entirely new book for the very first time and have no clue of what your future holds. But what you do know is that you must first change the direction you've been going and set a new course, a course away from the mainstream and back to what has been proven to work for thousands of years, a course which our ancestors steered us toward and we now have forgotten through our own selfish greed and carelessness. However, this book is not about the negative effects of our apathy or carelessness through acquiescence, because if you're reading this book now, you already know. Instead, it's about changing your course and taking control of your health and life. It's about choices and the freedom to choose what's best for you. It's about changing your world. We can't change the world until we first change our own world, the world right where you live. Then, encourage others to do so by being a living example of what is proven to work. As we have slowly found ways of feeding millions of people at a lower cost, we have paid a much higher price in the form of illness and death due to the effects of its synthetic chemicals. More and more people are waking up to realize the harmful effects of synthetic fertilizers. I don't put the blame on those who taught us to use chemicals. They didn't know any better. Many chemicals don't have an immediate effect on people, but slowly damages or kills over long periods of time. The problem I have is with the continued use and arrogance of ignoring the side effects due to the tremendous profitability and enormous implementations around the world. It's just too big of a ship to make such a sharp turn in the right direction. But you and I can make a difference by making that hard turn and teaching, encouraging, and empowering others to do the same. We can't dwell on the negative thinking, but must act positively and do something in our own lives. We must go from synthetic thinking to organic doing, until one day, that ship will be able to make that full turn. I see it already happening in my life and in others. Many are already waking up to embrace the lost knowledge of our forefathers. There's an awakening going on all over the world. It's a fusion of technology with the knowledge of the past. It's a course set in the right direction, and a course we never should have abandoned but embraced and improved upon. Years ago, I awakened to this forgotten blueprint of agricultural success when the so-called technological advancements failed me. I knew there had to be a better way for me and my family because... I was nearly burnt out, and quite frankly, so were my plants. Through diligent research and a call to action, I began to put the ancient theories to the test. Every living thing in life has a purpose, whether good or bad. I only needed to harness their potential benefits. What were these beneficial living creatures? Worms. They're everywhere. But why? Because plants are everywhere. Or should I say, plants are everywhere because worms are everywhere. They have a unique coexistence between each other. As the plant dies and falls to the ground, special microorganisms break down the decaying plant. The worms then eat the microbes. 
This is where the miracle happens. In the gut of a worm. Special bacteria in the worm feed on the bacteria that ate the decaying matter. The worms expel a very complex microorganisms that no other creature can duplicate. These special microbes are worm castings, in other words, worm poop, that smell just like natural earth. We need these microbes just as much as we do the worms, for this is what the plants consider their natural food, not synthetic fertilizers. Synthetic materials, many made from petrochemicals, actually kill the microbes that plants depend on. Chemicals are not plant food. This is what I was doing years ago, before becoming a worm farmer. Year after year, I became better at raising worms and feeding them. Growing a garden no longer became a guessing game, as I knew what the right food for my plant was. The answer was right under my nose, all along. I've awakened to the truth we've walked away from so long ago, and now the torch has been relit for me to share and pass on to you. Are you ready to wake up and lift the veil of deception from your eyes? If so, your journey back to the past, infused with the technologies of today, will not only enlighten you, but empower you to carry the torch and pass it on to others to help them see the light of a new agricultural tomorrow. This is the dawn of a new era. This is the awakening of truth and a call to action that you must embrace, or this ship may never turn from its course. Will you join me and others around the world and raise your torch against the man-made lies that are sown, which only reap illness and death? Will you join us in the fight to renew our lands and take back our health and well-being? Will you join us in the fight to say no to high-priced foods by growing your own at home? Will you join us in the fight for self-reliance, self-sufficiency, and freedom? Are you ready to be successful at growing healthy plants with high yields? If yes, then you're ready to join the Worm Farming Revolution.